Should Prince Harry be removed from the line of succession? 0207 862 222 is the number. Tell us what you think. A new poll of some 1,500 people has found that 52% of Brits think he should, with just 27% opposing the idea and 21% having no view at all. Now, we've got the line of succession here. Let's go and stick it on the Lionel Richie easel. <laughs> You'll see at the top, obviously, uh, the Prince of Wales, then Prince George, Princess Charlotte, Prince Louis, and there's Harry, uh, number fifth. Uh, there we, uh, he's currently fifth in line to the throne, retaining his position despite retiring as a working royal, giving up his HRH title in early 2020. Below him are the Duke of York and his family, Edward, the Duke of Edinburgh, his family and Princess Anne, the Princess Royal. That takes us all the way down to 17th in line to the throne. So, given all of that, Mike, should Harry be removed from the line of succession? Well, I think he should, but not for vindictive reasons, not to punish him because of the way that he's, you know, cashed in on the royal family, his own family, and made, you know, up to $100 million. I feel very sorry for Harry. I think he's a confused young man. He's not that young anymore. He's in his 30s, late 30s. But I, I think he's very confused about his position in the world and his role in life. I, it's almost as if somebody hit him over the head about six years ago and he's been wandering around in a daze ever since trying to find relevancy, trying to find out what he's doing. And I don't believe he'd ever be responsible enough to have a role in the British royal family in any way that influenced it. And for that reason, I think the king is absolutely right to have started pushing him away. Took Frogmore Cottage off him, told him he's going to lose his titles. That's absolutely right. He's got to be left alone now to find his own way in life. But he's not taking public money, is he? I mean, he's making his own money by these other no, means that no, you're No, but he's desecrated about. the royal family. Oh, come on. He has desecrated the royal come family. Oh, oh, come on, Nina. Oh, he please. tore the royal family to please. pieces while the late me. Queen Elizabeth II was alive. He Can you imagine the, the he things he said about wrote the family? A book about his family. His own father, King Charles, did exactly the same thing. Harry slagged off the present Queen, Queen Camilla, and accused her of selling stories about him and to Fleet I'm Street. No doubt, Absolutely no disgraceful. Doubt he, the fact that so many people in this poll are against Harry means that the palace machinery, aided by the media, has done a brilliant job, has done an absolutely brilliant job of tearing them down. And if anybody has read Spare, which is his, his uh, memoir, you will see detailed many, many instances where stories were leaked, there was no support, and that really Harry and Meghan were pushed out of this country because they were too popular. Those were his allegations, they, Nina. They were too popular. And what has to happen is that the palace wheels have to keep turning and the line of succession has to continue. So you have Charles and you have Camilla. And incidentally, you, uh, Charles, by the way, having been told by his mother that she was fine with Queen Consort for Camilla. Mm. And by the way, the Queen didn't actually ever, ever, ever countenance Camilla for years and years and years. Mm. All Charles wanted was to, to, to be in the succession to his mother and to have Camilla as his Queen. Well, the Queen said Queen Consort. After she died, what was the first thing he did? He made her Queen. He was King. He's King now. He so what? Sorry. So what? But he's gone against his own mother's wishes and she was right for a reason. The very idea of removing someone yeah. from the line of succession, does that sit right with you? If you have a family... It's, it's absolutely right. I mean, he, he's been disgraceful in his behaviour. disgraceful N at Nina's all. talking about his book spare and, and, st and talking about it as though it's all fact. It's all his allegations. You, I, he's been in court recently, Nina, and been told by a judge that it's very unlikely oh, that these on. stories you, were, were, you, were leaked through you phone work tapping. In you work yeah, I in do. Fleet Street. I do. You work in Fleet Street and you know as well as I do that there are editors sitting there with royal stories in their safes, ready to run with them. Yeah. So that's the power they hold over the royal family. I don't believe that there's you any blackmail going on from Fleet Street towards the royal always, family or any member of been, it. And, and Fleet Street has been used by the palace okay. because they needed to I, bring them down. I, I want to hear from our callers. Let's start with Pat in Ayrshire. 
is, Har is it right that Harry is still in the line of succession? Would it be right that an act of parliament, presumably, or a referendum or something of that nature, would be acceptable as a way of removing him, Pat? No, it shouldn't. And you're talking about 1,500 people. That's hardly a sort of full country poll, is it? And I Mike's going on about how disgraceful Harry's uh, acted. What about how Charles and Camilla acted? How about how Andrew's acted? And Sarah? How about all the money they've made? How about, are you, are you bashing Andrew? Might to get him removed from the violence succession? No, 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 you're not. None of those members of the royal family you've, you've just named turned against their own family. Oh, for and, and, oh hang on. Oh, don't talk rubbish. Pat, you're talking absolute rubbish. I'm not talking rubbish. absolute rubbish. He went to America and made $100 million on the promise that he would dig the dirt on the most famous family in the world, um, which happens to and be And what royal about family. the millions of pounds the royal family make from the seabeds around this country and what have you? You're talking. Prince Charles sat on the t live TV and dished uh, about Diana and about his marriage. And all you do is bash uh, uh, Harry. And I don't see why people bash Harry all because the time. Because Harry cashed it's in really on it. Not he cash in he on cashed it. in he on it in a massive it. way. He's earning, a, he's he earning a living because they wouldn't let him do exactly what Beatrice Thank and Eugenie you, do. Thank and you. They, they, Thank you. I mean, Nina's totally right. I mean, Beatrice and Thank Eugenie, you. it was on a documentary at the weekend. They are allowed to work, but they attend royal events, which is what uh, Harry and Meghan wanted to do. And they were told no, because like Nina said, they were too popular. Charles didn't like the fact that Diana was more popular than him. It runs in the family and William's exactly the same. OK, Pat, we're going to just pause there. Mike, one question I'd like to ask. Isn't yes. it the case that when you accept that your royal family is a family and they get the privileges and the rights that mm. go with that, you have to accept all of them. You have to accept all of them because that's the principle you started on. They're a royal family, they're, they're heads of state yeah. and Sorry, everything that goes with What do you mean, it. accept all of them? I... Well, you have to accept the line of succession follows yes. as, as until, it's laid out. Until somebody within the family so breaks the rules that you've just been talking right. about that they're no longer a credible how, member of that family. He Harry is not a done. credible member how of that family. Has Harry, what Harry has done, which is to, only to tell his own story, Yes. How is that worse than Andrew? Because if you remove Andrew from Harry from the line of succession, you get Andrew. Okay. Would you be happy with Andrew? Harry went private. No, 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 Harry let's, went into let's private take some enterprise. Calls. Let's take Answer some more calls. Questions. Of course Answer I'm not happy about Andrew. I think Andrew's a disgrace, well, okay. an absolute should he, disgrace. Should he, should he be removed from the line of Well, it certainly wouldn't upset me if he was. OK, let's well, are, hear are from you Helen. Are calling for him to be No, removed? I'm not. What I'm saying, that's the king's decision, but it wouldn't upset me no, if no, he no, was. It, His behaviour is so disgraceful. It may be the king's decision, but... Okay. Act of Parliament could do. I want to hear some more. I want to hear some, from Sorry. some more views. That's fine. Uh, Helen in Dorset, should Harry be removed from the line of succession? Is a referendum the right way to do that? Definitely yes. Okay. What's your reasoning? His behaviour was disgraceful towards Her Majesty the Queen, you. and I think he should be totally removed. And I think he, all this business about. Um, how popular he is is a load of rubbish. He's not, and neither is his wife. She's a dangerous woman. Oh, for heaven's how sake. How is she dangerous? Oh, for heaven's Helen. sake, Helen. Dangerous in what way? Because she's got a mouth on her like a horse. So... And she just, no, she insulted the Queen. She did not... She went on Oprah... She did and not she, insult the Queen. She did. she did not insult the Queen. She did. Nobody insulted the Queen. She How insulted was the Queen the insulted? Late queen. She didn't insult the Queen. And there's not one word that came out of the horse's mouth, as you call her, we which have, is very rude. We have to leave it we have to leave it there, guys. Honestly, we have I think to leave that's it there. Um, Nina, Mike, thank you. And thank you, Helen.